Hello friends from this video you can learn PHP array function like array flip function. By using this function you can flips or exchanges all keys with their associated values in array. In short array flip function returns an array in flip order, that is keys from array become values and values from array become keys. This function was introduced in PHP version 4 and it is present in PHP 7 also. This function returns the flip array on success and null value on failure. This is the simple syntax of this function, there is only parameter which is an array. In this function array is required and that specifies an array of key or value pairs to be flipped. First I have show you how to use this function with indexed array. So I have make this fruits array in which I have store three fruits name. Now I want to apply this array flip function. So I have create one variable flip is equal to array flip function with parameter like fruits array. By using this function keys and values are interchanged and store into flipped variable. After this I want to print this array on web page. So I have write print function with parameter like flipped variable and save this code and check who put in browser. Friends you can see one array on the screen and in this array now values of fruits array is now keys of this array and values are 0 1 2. This is because we have used indexed array. So this way array flip function interchange keys to values and values to keys. Now I have show you how to use this array flip function with associative array. So for this I have make one associative array with name like color and in this I have store color name as values with unique keys and for applying array flip function to this associative array I have just changes parameter of array flip function from fruits to color and save this color and check output in browser. Friends you can see that an array and in this array you can see that color arrays values are flipped to keys of this array and keys of color array are now the values of this array. I have find this function is very useful when you work with a big array and you want to know if a given value is in the array. In array function in fact becomes quite slow in such a case, but you can flip the big array and then use it to obtain the same result in a much faster way. Suppose friends if you apply this function to non-array variable then it will return warning message. For example I have make one variable test and in this variable I have store this text and I have change parameter of array flip function from color to this test variable and save this code and check output in browser. Friends you can see that warning message like array flip function expects parameter 1 to be array. So, this is the my video tutorial on array flip function. If you like this video please share this video with your friends or even you can share this video on social media also. Friends you want to get more update of my video. So, friends you can subscribe my YouTube channel. Friends you can also like my Facebook page also or you can also follow Webs Listen on Twitter.